Hey guys, it's Matt here from Pagni Advanced Simulation and welcome to Deal With The Experts where we provide you with tips and tricks on anything inside simulation. Today I'm going to be briefly showing you guys the difference between high-end and low-end pedals so that you make the correct purchase for next time. So let's get right into it. In this video I'm going to be going through the common, most popular pedals for purchase. These being the standard T3PAs by Thrustmaster, the T3PA Pros, and the Fanatec Club Sport V3 pedals. Overall, these three pedal sets all function the same. They clearly all have a throttle, brake, and a clutch. However, if you're really wanting to step up your simulation game, you really need to look into the key features of these pedal sets to make sure that they're perfect for you. So let's get into those features on each pedal. So firstly, we're gonna be looking at the standard T3PA pedal set. Their overall design is mainly just plastic, but they also have these metal pedal plate covers on the top. So on the top of each pedal plate, they have different mounting holes that you can actually adjust each plate to. So this is really handy if you want to have the brake pedal maybe slightly closer to the throttle. So I actually like to change these around a bit on our showroom, which is really cool. So another really cool feature about this pedal set is the rubber brake cone that you get with it. What this does is it just makes your brake a lot more realistic and it can be easily added to the pedal set. All right, so the next pedal set we're gonna be looking at is the T3PA Pros. These are very similar to the standard T3PA pedals, but do have more of an industrial look to them. They do offer some different features, which is really cool compared to the standard T3PA pedals. So the awesome feature that they offer is you can actually turn these into inverter pedals. So instead of just having them flat on the ground like this, and just like the standard pedals, you can actually have them hanging. So they can simply be turned around like this, where you can invert the pedals on your wheelbase, and this allows you to then have your pedals hanging and function the exact same way as if they were to be flat. I find this a really cool feature. We have it set up like this in our showroom and we really enjoy it. So as well as that feature, it also has the brake cone feature that you can have added, which is the exact same as the standard T3PA pedals. These pedals are really good for their price. Uh, it is a definite worthy investment if you wanna get these compared to the standard T3PA pedals as the standard ones are very much an entry level pedal set. So lastly, we have the Fanatec Club Sport V3 pedals. Now the T3PA and T3PA Pro pedals are really good, but if you really wanna step up your simulation game, this is where you need to start looking at some of Fanatec's pedals. They aren't just your standard plastic pedal set. These things are the best of the best, and they have a nice anodized black metal on the front. Same with their pedals, are extremely nice and have a black and silver finish. They've also got this red, finish on the back. They're just overall such a nice looking pedal set. But as well as their looks, they definitely pack a punch. So, so Fanatec does offer some really cool accessories for their pedal sets. So the one that we always recommend to our customers is the dampener kits. So these can be added to your throttle and they can also be added to the brake. So that does increase the strength on each pedal. So it's definitely a worthy investment to get some of those and attach them to these pedal sets. And overall, they don't invert like the T3PA Pros, but I don't think that's necessary when you have such strong pedals like this. You can really just feel the difference between a full metal pedal set and the T3PA Pros and the standard T3PAs where it's, it is more of an entry level and plastic feel. These pedals are a bit more premium priced, but if you do want to have a realistic setup, these are what you need to get. I guarantee you won't be disappointed in them, so definitely check these out before you decide on what pedals you want to go with. All right guys, I hope you enjoyed today's video and the information that we provided was very useful. If you guys are interested in any of these pedal sets, then please check out the link in the description as we have these all available for purchase on our website. If you do have any more questions about any of these pedal sets though, then please contact us via support at paganinimports.com.au as we're more than happy to help you out with any questions. I'll see you guys in the next video. Yeah.